big issues, they don't want to see anything. Oh. They don't want to see themselves. They don't want to see anything. They want to sit and be blind. And I'll tell you this, if you know you have happiest adventure is calling you, you have to be intentional about seeing the planet, seeing the environment you live in, and how you feel about it. Number one, happiness is calling you to adventure because the only reason why you have happiness is because you failed to adventure into yourself. So you must now be intentional about traveling and traveling does not cost money. You can travel around your village, my friend. Just walk around your village. Cover the circumference of your village. Start there. Remember when you walk, the way appears. Start from where you can. I know some people, when I say about traveling, they're now thinking, but I don't have flight money. You don't have any excuse. As long as your ties are shaking, you're doing the work. As long as ties are shaking, you are doing the work. Now travel, see different cultures and places around your village, country, or even continent if you can. Mm -hmm. Yes, you must be an adventurous spirit. Ha happiness is for people who are not adventurous. Yo. If you're a Sagittarius, you are not supposed to be catching happies. If you have happies as a Sagittarius, you are a failure to your bloodline. I'm, not, Yo. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. Now, engage in a lot of lower body exercises. You see this thing that South Africans like doing that? These things that Africans do, oh, you think they are uncivilized. Africans are lazy. Africans, we don't like to do too much work for, for, for results. And it's true, we are lazy. We don't like to do too much work for results because there are shortcuts. If me using myself only in and tells me shaking my knees, why would I go to work? <laughs> if me being successful only entails my 12 houses, my 12 houses being successful, why would I use another way? Why would I go to Harvard? Africans shortcut. Africans love shortcuts. We are the most shortcut people on the planet because we use our body to heal. Mm. We use our body to do everything. The 12 tribes of Israel, that is where everything is. Some people, they think they have to go to Europe to succeed. No, in Africa, an African will only tell you, shake your body from your head to toe, and then you will see your life fall into place fall into place and this is an assignment i've not forgotten my students my students this is an assignment that i gave you there are some students that i gave this assignment of shake parts of your body every day the way i told you from monday to monday to monday and then see how your life is going shaking your body shakes the dna shaking your body shakes the dna so for mm. example happiness you need to shake your thighs i don't know how you will shake them i don't know whether you'll get a vibrator to make sure that your thighs are always shaking. But remember that you seeing yourself, just like I told you, it is embedded. How to awaken your self-vision DNA is to shake your thighs. Your thighs have junk DNA that will awaken. Oh, yeah, shake, shaking shaking me. Oh, yeah, shake, if you want to know yourself, even dancing is, is a Achilles. form of healing. You always see luos. The luos in the house here. You always see those luo raw people, they're always like this. Shaking the Achilles heel, always shaking the Achilles heel, and they can go long distances just doing this. Shaking the Achilles heel, shaking the Achilles heel. When you shake your Achilles heel, you are already tapping into your self knowledge, my friend. So, why would you go to school? Why would you go to school? Somebody is, and, and I will tell you this, when I do, some people will not believe me. Right now in Kenya, there is a guy who is a Kamba guy, he is Kamba. This guy was saying, congratulations to my fancy. That guy, he did not step, set foot in school. All he does is shake his ass. And I'm telling you, he's going to go far. He's going to go far than people who went to med school. He's going to go far than people who went to engineering and piloting school. Feel yourself. Why? Then because he's move. shaking his confidence. And he's a man. And he's a man. And in this world, confidence is among the big five. I told you who the big five were. He's already shaking his confidence and he's already moving crowds right now. You don't need to go to Harvard in order for you to move crowds and get your money and live your adventurous life. 
Shake the parts of the body that needs to be shaken. If you need to support yourself, just go the Ethiopian way. Go the Ethiopian way. Shake your neck and make sure that your neck is strong and you will see. Because do you know what the white man does? The white man made sure that even our dancers, we were not dancing anymore because he knew that our secrets were in our dances. The moment they make sure that your neck is weak, and that is where they target the most. Your neck is where they target the most. When your neck is weak, your head will separate from your body and you're dead. So your self-support, guys. Self-support. Self-support, and especially Africans. Africans, you must support yourself for oh, nobody's going to support you. You see the Europeans, they support themselves so much that Taylor Swift does not even have to post herself. She's already being posted by everybody. She's so supported. Africans, we don't have that. And you must know. A lot of our ancestors' necks were cut. Self-support is not there. So you must support yourself from your own level, first of all. This is even the reason why it is so hard for African artists to even, you know, go to bigger lens because of self-support. And our African artists think that you can have the same support that Taylor Swift has. You will never have because them, their ancestors are intact from up to 12 centuries. As we, a lot of us were cut, a lot of us were cut, a lot of our necks were cut, a lot of our necks were cut. So when you see me, even me, I'm only supporting myself here. You must, you have no option. You have no option. You either support yourself, or your neck is cut. Your neck is cut. And remember, your self-support is where your money is. Your self-support is where your money is and where your voice is. So you must be consistent and be very intentional about supporting yourself. And don't let anybody buy you from supporting yourself. Because we have a lot of zombies in Africa. People who cannot support themselves, they want others to not support themselves. Because misery loves company. Yo. Don't let anybody interfere with your work. Court, Africans, court. Be vigilant. Be vigilant. If somebody dares to interfere with your self support, court, my friend. Don't even joke with people. And when you take people to court, ask for big money. Take people to court for billions. Maybe if you joke with me, I will take you to court and I will drain your entire lineage. I will make sure that you are poor up to the seventh generation. I will ask you for money that you will not be able to give me. Even after you've sold all the land, all your ancestral lands. So don't joke with people. Because that's how Europeans are. Albanians, they don't joke. You joke and they, they literally slaughter you alive. Mm -hmm. When you see their systems of punishment, you will be shocked. You will be shocked. So don't joke with people. Don't joke with people when people come to joke with their self-support. We will, Our self-support here... We only have one, 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 one. Like me, I only have to support myself. Like literally, we support ourselves. In Africa, we stand on our own. We don't have parents. Europeans, they have parents. You find Billy Eilish is supported by the entire world. Everybody's happy behind her back. Her music, she's supported in that music. She's supported in production. She's being supported in costuming, in fashion. She's being supported in venue. Support Everything yourself. she's supported. Africans not even Extremely. One. And if you're an African, you don't know that life is a DIY support project. Yourself. You know so. As Africans, nobody's going to support you. I'll tell you for free. <laughs> Get into it. Get into it. Because I'm, I'm telling you, they will, they will not support you. And especially the Albedos, when you carry black excellence, they want nothing to do with you. Albedos, when you carry black excellence, they want nothing to do with you. And the writings are on the walls. Look at Africans who are excellent. We are busy making it on our own. Nobody is coming to make it easy for you. Nobody's. In fact, when they want to work with us, they even want to pay us less. <laughs> These Albedos, they want to work with us, they want to pay us less. They don't want to support you. They want to, don't want to support you. Somebody saying they support Tyler because Tyler is one of theirs. Tyler is one of theirs. That is why they, they are now saying that Tyler is the best musician from South Africa that they've ever seen. Haven't we seen better music from South Africa than Tyler's? Haven't we seen? But right now they're busy saying, oh, Tyler is the best South Africa has ever had. In fact, the genre she's even singing is not even South Africa. Didn't we have Sarafina in South Africa? Haven't we had better music, better vocals, sacred vocals from South Africa, but they've made it nowhere? 
And then Tyler comes with, make me easy. Make me, and then te she's taken everywhere. Ask yourself why. <laughs> Is her music paying any homage to the South African roots? No. It is only supporting the white South African, the colored South Africans are the ones who can do late. But the sacred South Africans, there's nothing about Tyler that is sacred in South Africa. So when she's been supported by Europe, by Europe, by Europe, it's because she's their blood, my friend. She's theirs. So no. No. See things the way they are. As an African, if you know you are an excellent African, support yourself. You must awaken the buffaloes. The buffaloes are in African Serengeti. They are in African Serengeti. Awaken them within yourself. Because when you awaken the buffaloes, the buffaloes are unruly. The buffaloes are wealth that cannot be controlled by anybody. Right now, Europeans have their wealth, but it can be controlled by the people. The people say that we are not buying Starbucks. Starbucks is dead. The people say we are not buying Balenciaga. Balenciaga is dead. But the type of wealth that comes from Africa, it comes from the Serengeti, from the Serengeti totems. Meaning you awaken a buffalo type of wealth within yourself, nobody, nobody will ever come and say that, oh, we need to cancel Surinyar Kano's wealth. We need to make sure that Surinyar Kano does not. If my wealth is buffalo totem, you will not be able to do anything about it. You will not be able to do anything about it. And those are the types of wealth that Africans need to have. And our ancestors are making sure that those are the type of wealth that we have because they want us to make it alone. In Europe, when you look at Beyonce having a concert, that concert of Beyonce knows that... ...was sponsored, first of all. There are people who... waiting for that man. That money comes out from Beyonce's concert and it is being divided among so and so and so and so and so and so. In Africa, we're going to have the type of wealth where it comes out and it's yours. <laughs> you are nobody's going to control you. European what me, I have been. Like literally, I, I was part of the Project X. Guys, a European man will give you money and he will want to make sure that they see where it is going. They make sure that there are things you cannot buy with that money. They make sure that that money, you cannot use it to help yourself. Yo. In fact, most of the time, they give you money. Oh, you want money to do surgery? It is there. Oh, you want money to start a business back in Africa? No, it is not there. Oh, you want money to travel to Europe? It is there. Oh, you want money to, to, to rent a house in Europe, a very expensive house? It's there. Oh, you want money to go up in, start agriculture in Africa? It is not there. That is the type of money that they have. It is not buffalo. It is not the buffalo totem because it is control. It is blood money. If you want true good money, a lot of you, you are going for that money. You don't know that money is not good money. Not all money is good money. Such a, some money you get into it and you, you lose your wings. So stay in Africa and go for the buffalo totems. Get money that nobody will control you over. Those are the buffaloes in Serengeti. <laughs> Those are the buffaloes in Serengeti. Leave Tyler. Tyler, every, so many people are behind her. So many people. Do you want to have money where so, so many people are behind you? By the time you're going home, you're going home with 10%. What the fuck is that? Don't no. fall for the European. I want 100%. Don't fall for it. It is an illusion. There's no freedom there. And they leave it on edition so much that when the public decides, they are gone. The public decides they are dead. They can be cancelled any time. That is not a buffalo wealth. <laughs> that is not a buffalo wealth. Do you guys know wealth? Wealth was the type of wealth that Mansa Musa had. Mansa Musa had wealth. His wealth that he made from his knowledge of astrology. Nobody could control it. So have wealth that cannot be controlled. Have wild wealth. Don't have cows that you domesticate. Even when you're asking for wealth, Totem, don't go for cows that you can domesticate. Go for the wild animals in Serengeti. <laughs> because your cows, you will eat them. Don't go for wealth that you will eat and then it is over. Go for wealth that is wild animal that runs around and that can defend itself. I claim it, I speak it, I manifest it. Wealth that can defend itself, wealth I that can hunt on its own. that is 100% on me and 100% on the mind of Don't go for wealth that you domesticate and then tomorrow you kill it, it is gone.
success, no. wealth, and happiness, positivity, money. I speak it on myself Many and I speak content. it on all of you. Full class on my YouTube.